Hey guys, welcome back. It's Paul here. And in this video, I'm basically going to be showing you how to use free download manager. Now, this is another download manager app for Android. And of course, as always, I'm going to be showing you how to use it. It's best settings. And finally, if I would recommend someone to use this app in comparison to the other two download managers that I've recently talked about in my videos, that is 1DM and ADM. And of course, I'm going to be leaving links of those videos in the video description below so that you can go ahead and check them out in case you haven't. Otherwise, without any further ado, let's get right into it. Now, free download manager can be downloaded from the Play Store by simply opening the Play Store. Then you're going to search for FDM. So open the Play Store, then you search for FDM. Now the first user that you're going to be seeing here is free download manager so basically go ahead and download and install this app since mine is already installed i'm basically going to go ahead and open it and i'll be showing you how to use it now there are a number of ways you can use free download manager the first one being using this plus icon here so when you go ahead and tap on this icon what you're going to do here is paste in your download link here so you can go ahead and paste your download link here or you can also browse the torrent file for instance have a torrent file that is ready to be downloaded here so basically what you can do is tap on this file option look for your torrent file then go ahead and download it so for instance i've already put my torrent file here so basically what i'm going to do is go ahead and download it so tap on download and as you can see the download is going to start now before i talk about the best download settings and also use the inbuilt browser of this app so when you go to options here then you go to browser so as you can see, there is this option of browser. So you tap on it and you can use this browser as a normal browser to search your favorite websites and go ahead and get your downloads now. Basically, that is how you can use this app. Otherwise, that's it for this video. Catch you in the next one. Of course, don't forget to subscribe in case you haven't. And give this video a thumbs up in case you've liked it. Have a nice time. Peace.